right so showing here with MPWGL we have a leak right here in this area running right here it's gonna either be coming from these lines here I want to know if it's basically underground or if it's going from inside of the mixer itself and coming down somewhere in the block in here so we go in and do a little testing here with the leak detector so we go and hook up the leak detector here and do a scan check to make sure that it's either in the floor or up in the air and um you'll know for sure exactly what it is so the way not to burst up two areas they say the ground was already raising up so they ain't too sure if it's from the ground or if it's up on top so you go and mount up here and get everything running i believe i'll use the one for the the wall here and start from the wall and just checking the wall after from experience and touching the wall and stuff i find a feeling and hearing a little noise up there so that the first part we go and check first before we use the one for the flooring so we get set up all right so we get started here the main unit as we'll be using this one here on the wall if I'm talking too loud is because I have the headset on my ears I tried everything already fully charged Tighten up that there and uh, you can see the process of it powering on Turn on the camera this way and get set up a little bit here Alright so we have the sensor here where you can use the walls and this is the main unit here so we get everything turned on Now we do have a few people, a few persons asking, you know how it operates, how we find leaks, how we locate everything. It's actually on here right now because of the glare, you might be able to see it properly. Right, but all you'll be using right now is just um, general location, which is you want to the left hand side. As I said, I have plenty light out, so you might be able to see. And let's adjust the setting. On this side, we'll create only sensitivity basically straight on. Just to start off on that setting, you don't want everything too hard, and then volume for the ears, you don't want that too hard as well. And right, let's press a button here, and everything is moving here. So the bars, you can see the bars there when I touch, touch it it is going up so we're going and start checking on the wall and see how the buying looking so we are getting some readings here on the wall already hopefully you could see there a little bit about halfway there right now on the wall so we come higher up and the headphones i'm here are more I'm more pronounced song coming out of it here and I see more activity on the screen. But I say sorry if you all can see the screen too good. We'll come up a little higher. And here actually getting full volume here and it almost about three quarter there, almost to the full level. So we we are done getting a high reading up to the top here. Wait on this side, basically the same thing. So from what I get in here right now is basically this area here. So I'm putting everything on here. Actually putting the sensors to the top here and with the headphones I could actually hear all the songs coming from inside the wall. And the highest readings was right around this area. I had it start off from the lower area. And the volume was pretty low. You check on the hot side. 
So you can see here, hot side is really low. Hopefully you can get to see that. But the volume on this side readings are very low here. If we just put it on the floor just to see if we hear him on the ground outside here, yeah, sorry, to see what um, we hear in out here. Uh, basically no readings whatsoever. We are getting a little small readings on that side here. Yeah. But that is distortion from the leak that we actually hear in, in the wall right now. Put it on this side here. Yeah. Let's see, we're getting some minor little distortions here, but there's no leak under there because I could hear it with the headphones, so I know for sure there's no leak here. So right here, which are the mixer, cold water going into the mixer, it have some um, some leaking line inside here, so they will just need to burst up this area here, find the leak and patch it. They would need to um, burst up the floor in or interfere with the hot water line, so it's just the cold water line. Alright, showing with MPWGL. See you guys next time.